we um, called Dick Schwartz and asked him if he would train us. And at that time, there were no training. So we, he, we were in a consultation group with him, which I stayed in for about 10 years. And um, Dick trained each of us to become an IFS therapist. And um, it, the work, um, because I was already body-centered and already doing Hakomi, the work seemed to just really add on this whole other dimension. This working with self-energy just changed everything for me and made everything, um, just made my work so exciting and just brought everything to life. And my clients started to pop really easily. I, the work seemed effortless and beautiful and the, the profound ways that people were changing just, and the profound ways I was changing with my own work just made me so excited I wanted to I wanted to learn more, teach more, do more, become a bigger part of it. So it's been my passion in my professional life for almost 20 years, and it's very exciting to me. So. You know, I, I, I supervise a lot of therapists, too, and what I, what I realize is that people get burned out doing the work. You know, as, as therapists, and I run into therapists all the time at parties or whatever that are talk therapists, and they're just doing right, they, they look tired, they look exhausted, they look like they're not having a lot of fun. And so when I teach students, my wish is that they have as much passion for being a healer and a therapist as I do, or as the people that I'm close to do as all of us, as IFS therapists. And begin to have access to that route of helping people heal so that they can have passion for their work and they can help heal other people. I'm probably a little more experiential than a lot of other folks because of my Hakomi, but well, there's several of us who have a Hakomi background, including you. I'm very, um, experientially oriented, body-centered. Um, my, my desire is to give people an experience of the work so that they can really feel it and body it and move from that and then give them um, some didactic about what they just experienced. Mm -hmm. So it's a combination of um, moving into the work and then explaining it and moving into the work and then explaining it. And, um, and a, and a bit more bias on people doing their own work. Um, I, think, I think the more people do their own work, um, the better therapists they're going to be, and the more excited they're going to be about the work. So I try to create a passionate, kind of exciting environment. Taking people into the body more, um, having people actually experience the work. So, so a lot of, a lot of uh, partnering, doing the work together, um, uh, movement work, having people kind of um, have parts embody them and move towards them. So I might do a little, little more with like a parts mapping where actually people actually embody the parts and embody self. Well, I, you know, I, it's interesting to me that a lot of my clients are therapists. So, um, and I, I share my excitement with them. I share my passion for the work with them and let them know um, that there's a way to work with people that's both um, intellectual, spiritual, um, embodied, kinesthetic, and, and something that will help them be passionate about their work using self-energy um, is so powerful and it, and it creates, there's less effort on the part of the therapist. And people want that, you know, they don't want to be working so hard and feeling like they have to fix people and so it just, it just, you have a lot more assistance with IFS as a therapist. I'm really busy as a therapist. I see almost between 25 and 30 people a week and I don't get burned out from my work. You know, that's the biggest thing. It's like I, there's so much self-energy in the room when I'm working that I feel like it feeds me rather than depletes me. Um, I feel more passionate about my work. It's more exciting. Um, I watch people change 
quickly. Um, it's very, it's very, it's a very intimate process. Um, so I, I just, I get to, I get to go home feeling like I just did something incredible all day long. You know, change people's lives and um, in a really beautiful, incredible way. I have some teachers, you know, who have um, discovered working with their students in ways that they start to share with students the idea of multiplicity. And it, it just, it broadens people's world. Um, I think the, the self component is a spiritual component, I think. And so it broadens people's lives, you know, in, in whatever context they use it. I know that there has been, you know, that sometimes there's some thought about only keeping IFS to therapists, but I am not, I'm not one of the fan. I'm, I'm a big fan of let's share it with the world. You know, I think it's, I think it's beneficial for everyone. I now have a way to work with my own parts. So on the spot. So if parts come up for me, I have access to knowing how to work with them myself. I mean, sometimes I'll have a friend or a colleague. I'm, I still work with a therapist. I mean, to this day, I, I do my own work constantly. You know, it's, it's, I feel like it's a lifetime process for me. Mm -hmm. So I work with someone, but I'm, I'm able to work with this myself in the moment, be able to work with my parts, calm them down, create enough space so that self is leading and I'm just a different person in the world. More empowered, uh, my relationships are better, eternally grateful. Well, particularly with Hakomi, which, um, I, you know, I love Hakomi. I'm a great fan of it. And, but there was a way that um, it was up to us to really work with the young parts. It was really our job to kind of come in and work with the young parts. A lot of responsibility, a lot of sense of, oh, it's up to me. And with IFS, my job is to create a connection between parts and self so that self can take the leadership, so that self is really the, the the important relationship right there. And it takes the burden off of me as a therapist. No longer feel so responsible or so burdened. And it lightens things up. And it, it teaches the client to, it teaches them to fish. Rather than my being the fisherman, yes. it teaches them to fish. And that's the big difference for me. And, and people learn to do this on their own. Like they have the capacity, they're not as dependent on me, so they have the capacity to go off and once they learn how to do it, they can do this anywhere. So, it's beautiful. My first reaction was, this is so stupid. It's like ridiculous, parts, you know, I just didn't, I didn't buy it. My first experience meeting Dick and having going inside and working with a part, I was a convert immediately. It was like the first moment that I went inside and worked with my parts. That was it for me. I was, I've been a fan for, since that day. How easy it was to get people to join in. It was like the minute that people heard about it, and not heard about it, but the minute they experienced it, people were just on board. It was really quick. So, so to having the faith to kind of, <clears throat> to kind of move out of um, IJR and Northwestern and actually move into creating our own trainings. Um, you know, how easy that was and how, how effortlessly that.